What's up everybody? Kaylin Ryden here with my beautiful wife. Hey guys, I'm Jade Ryden. Oh, lovely. We are here to show you how to do your New Mexico United tie-dye kit. Yep. It's gonna be an adventure today. I've never done tie-dye before. I've done it a long time ago, so this, this will be fun though. All right guys, so in your tie-dye kit, you're gonna get some really cool colors. You've got Drag like a dragon, dragon fruit. fruit, it's red. red. And you've got a cobalt blue, that looks pretty cool. A bright yellow, a lilac purple, and a robin egg blue. Mm. Obviously you'll mix these with warm water. And then you've also got this soda ash fixer and you'll also mix this with warm water. So that's what you get in your kit. And we and have two t-shirts. Whichever size that you need, you will get. All right guys, step one, uh, you're gonna want a wet t-shirt. So run it through the washer, uh, soak it in some water, whatever you prefer, but the shirt must be wet. These are wet, damp, ready to go. Okay, step two, we need a bucket and uh, some warm water. We are putting a quart of water into this bucket and mixing it with this soda ash fixer. You're gonna wanna wear a glove so you can mix it all up. Yes, very serious. Put on your gloves, people. Very safe. All right, here comes our quart of warm water into our bucket. And soda ash fixer. Mm-hmm, straight in. Now I'm just gonna mix it all up. With her glove. With my glove. All right, we are moving on to step three. Well, you could say step four. Step three was mix it, step four now. Sure. Whatever you guys want, whatever step is next. Okay, we're now grabbing our shirts and we are going to soak them in this warm water with our soda ash fixer for 15 minutes. Boom. Yeah, glove. I didn't have a glove on. <laughs> I'm just gonna roll it around in there. Roll it around? Yeah. Let them soak, huh? Let them soak. We're letting our shirts soak. While they soak, my wife's gonna let you know what we're doing next. All right, so we're gonna mix up our colors. So these are all the colors you get in your kit. So you can pick which colors you wanna use. You can use all of them, whatever floats your boat, right? Um, I think I'm gonna go with robin egg blue and dragon I'm, fruit red. I'm going bright yellow, of course. This is a uh, New Mexico United yellow, actually. Um, which one did you? I'm doing uh, robin egg blue and dragon fruit red. I kind of want it. Okay, I'm gonna do the other blue, cobalt blue and yellow. That's gonna be my combination. Clearly, a better combo that. than those two. <laughs> Okay. We'll see. So we are taking off the lids here. And you want to fill these little bottles up about 70-80% with your warm water that we still have here. Um, so here we go. Here we go. Boom. And then the cap goes back on and a little shake. A little shake. Mix it up. Uh, Ooh. Ooh. Uh-oh, we have our first mess. Let's see if I can do it better. I think the key is to kind of swirl. <laughs> Hold it away from key. your body and swirl. Swirl. Ladies and gentlemen, had a tie-dye spill, had to put the gloves on. We can continue now. <laughs> uh, we are still mixing colors together. Uh, my New Mexico United yellow got all over the table and my fingers. <laughs> Mine did not spill. Just want to note that. Okay. I'm going to take after Jade here and, and swirl, swirl it like she did. Boring. Swirling is the key. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's beautiful. Boom. Yellow. 
Global Blue. Ready to rumble. Okay, step. Six? 12, who knows? <laughs> okay, shirts have been soaking for 15 minutes. We're gonna pull them out. Um, I don't know which one's, hopefully this is mine because I already have my stuff on yeah, it. You. Oh, perfect. All right, we're gonna pull them out. Whoa. Uh, we're gonna ring dry these bad boys. Uh, we still want them wet, but not like dripping wet. So. All right, oh, this is wrung seat. out, not dripping, ready to go. All right, t-shirts back on the table or whatever surface you're using at home. So what technique are you gonna use? Uh, I'm gonna do the pull up and twist technique. Would you like to demo that? <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> um, I'm not gonna go right in the middle though, you know? I'm gonna kinda, I'm gonna maybe go off to one side. Mm. Oh, it'd be right here. I'm gonna go like to where, I want the center of my tie-dye to be like where your heart would be on your uh, on your shirt. So we're gonna go like right here. Very I'm gonna kinda side. pick this up like this. And we're just gonna start turning like this. Wow. Wow, look at this. That's actually decent. Okay, and then we're just gonna kind of squeeze this all kind of together, kind of tuck in the sides. See, you've got a nice little spiral here from the epicenter of your little tie-dye. And... How are you gonna get the um, rubber bands on? I'm just gonna start putting them on. Just however. All right, well, what is your technique? What are you doing over here? Um, I'm here to make art, so I'm gonna do something different. Like? Um, I'm trying to think what I wanna do. I like to just like, just, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, like, like how you fold laundry at home, <laughs> just like that. <laughs> well, so now, uh, with whatever you go, if you go artsy, just or, no rhyme or reason. Or just, JD, whatever you want to call it. Just, or if you want to be simple like me and just do the normal way, fine. Whatever floats your boat. Um, <laughs> yeah. Oh uh, man, I got some of your yellow on here. Yeah. Because of that freaking table. Okay. Ah! Uh. Um, you know, I don't really have like a plan. Just um, just put rubber bands on here, just so there's like some some little different nooks and crannies pockets on the t-shirt. Yeah. yeah. Um, I just went with your classic cross rubber band uh, situation. Just putting rubber bands around it to secure it on all sides. Tie-dye is never really good or bad. It's just always it unique just to is, you. It just is, you know? We are complete. Rubber bands, shirts are ready to be tie-dyed. We have discovered the other side of this t-shirt after this roll. I mean, look at the detail. Look at the fine lines, the tight lines here. Troy would be buzzing to see these tight lines right here. Step number seven, or whatever we're on. Pretty sure it's seven. Um, we are going to now soak our shirts in our little paint here. And yeah, you're just gonna saturate it completely with all your colors. And just go after it. All right, here we go. go. We're getting to work. I'm gonna start off with uh, the blue first. Do I take this off? Oh yeah. Okay. I'm gonna start here soon, I promise. Aha, there we go. <laughs> Right, so I'm actually gonna go, I'm gonna go on this side first here. Oh, wow. It's a lot. Yeah, it is. So just, okay. I, I, I'm, 
I've made the sudden decision. I'm gonna, I've got a pink rubber band here down the middle and I'm gonna go one side of it, cobalt blue, and the other side, New Mexico United yellow. I'm just making art. I don't know. My divide is the pink, the pink rubber band over here. I might dabble, I might dabble. I might go over here with a couple, a couple yellow on this side. Mix it up. Get a it's all saturated up with our colors. They look beautiful. And now we're gonna put these in some Ziploc baggies. And you wanna let these set from at least four to 24 hours. And the longer you let them set, the more vibrant the colors are gonna be. Cool. We have shirts in Ziploc bags. Um, once these are done uh, marinating, for uh, four to 24 hours. Then you'll wanna bring these out, you know, soak them, wash them in a sink, in a bathtub, whatever With is your preference. Water. Warm water, warm water. Um, and if you'd like to, maybe throw it in the washer after you do that. Not necessary. Then maybe you're good to go. Maybe recommended, yeah. not sure. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, our shirts are in the Ziploc bags. We're so excited to see them. And we're excited to see yours as well. So Absolutely. whenever you guys are done, even though they're probably not going to be as good as ours, please feel free to share, you know, tag New Mexico United, show everyone uh, your designs at home. Again, thank you so much from both of us. Yeah, absolutely. Hope you guys have fun while you're making shirts. Us ride-ins, we're signing out. Somos Unidos. Thanks, guys.